Alrighty guys, the HIPAA chain with the 45, 20, halfway between 25 and 30 in the tilt. Uh, the same 24 inch bar I had on my uh, 7310. This is my very, very hot uh, OEM 372 that uh, I actually detuned a little bit. I haven't had it back to the dyno to see where she's pushing, but it used to push nine horners, but uh, I calmed it back some uh, with a muffler. Uh, just got tired of it uh, bellering my ears out. But uh, it's been, you guys don't see this one much on the channel. Uh, so uh, let's uh, do some cutting with it. This is one of my favorite 372s, and I'm not a huge 370Q fan. But, uh, the sun is cooking me, but, uh, there's the chips on that. And, uh, let's, uh, let's cut some hardwood with it as well. Um, because I know the wood critics are going to be like, oh, but you're cutting top wood. But, uh, but, uh, I'm... F-tards don't seem to understand is uh, softwood will pull saw down harder than hardwood. Uh, so I got some oak right here. So I'm going to pause you while I get some of this stuff off here. And uh, we'll cut the, this dirty oak up right here. And uh, we'll see how that uh, HIPAA chain does. The plus side, uh, I'd like to get some cuts on it before we smoke it. But if I bottom it out in a rock or, or through here or whatever... Uh, it's that junky HIPAA chain. I can uh, throw it back on the grinder and whip up a different grind and uh, do an entirely different video on a different different grind for you guys if you're interested in that. But let me pause you, get this cleaned out, and then uh, I'll bring you back. It, uh, I can't get that long piece up. I don't got it in me to get it up off there. I'm not hurting my back. But uh, typically I'd have my tractor out here and I would use the forks and set these things up on like a pile of wood or something so i wouldn't cut down in the dirt but uh let's cut to some very seasoned hard oak and uh this is red oak and uh let's see how the the hippie chain survives uh with this
is idling a little low. I don't got my screwdriver. But, uh, I don't know. You guys let me know what you think. It, uh, I can tell it lost a little bit with that quieter muffler. But, uh, she is still plenty respectable. And my ears aren't ringing when I'm done playing with it. So, yeah, let me know what you guys think. Like I said, that one I plan on keeping for a while. So, you guys take it easy and have a good one.